All right, guys, to start things off, we're going to head on over to desmume.org. The link to this page will be in the description below. Once you're here, look to your right, you'll see pages and under pages, you'll see downloads. Go ahead and click on that. And then you're going to see your stable releases and your nightly bills. We're going to download the latest stable release. So go ahead and click this first link, which is a GitHub page. And the latest release as the recording of this video is 0.9.13. Now we have a download available for Mac OS, OpenMU, and Windows. I'm on Windows, so I'm going to download the Windows 64 zip. Go ahead and click on it, and your download should start. The file is downloaded and I have saved it onto my desktop. Now the file will be in a format that needs to be extracted. I use 7-zip to extract my files. If you guys need to download 7-zip, there will be a link in the description below. Once you have 7-zip installed, all you need to do is come back to this file, right click on the file, go to 7-zip, extract here. And then you will see this file right here, which is the emulator. Let's go ahead and open it. Now when you first open the emulator, you're gonna notice that the window is kinda small. To make this a little bigger, let's go up to view, window size, and let's go times two. Now the first thing we're gonna do is go up to config, 3D settings. Now if your PC has an AMD graphics card, you wanna leave everything here at default settings for the best performance. But if you have an Nvidia graphics card, you wanna change the 3D rendering engine to OpenGL 3.2, for better performance okay now let's go back up to config and since we are using an nvidia graphics card we want to change our display method to opengl as well now we're going to set up our controller let's go back up to config one last time and control config now the button that's ready to be emulated will be highlighted green in this case it's asking what button do we want to be up so all we do is press up on our xbox one controller now it wants left, press left, down, right, B, and just continue through here and set up all of your buttons. And once you're finished, go ahead and click OK. And that's all for setup. Now let's load a game. Let's go up to file, open ROM, and locate wherever you keep your ROMs on your computer. In my case, I keep mine on an external hard drive. Go ahead and select the game. I'm going to select Contra 4 and hit open and the game should load up. Now, if you want to change your screen layout, go up to view, LCD layout. Right now it's on vertical. We're going to change it to horizontal. Go back up to view, LCD layout, and you can also change it to one LCD. Let's change it back to vertical. Way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change Been through a lot of pain Things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago oh, 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 oh.